Well, uh, good morning, everyone, and, and thanks for being here. Um, special welcome to our media guests. Special welcome to everybody online. Um, it's obviously a, a great day, a great to be here at the job one ceremony of, of the all-new Ford GT supercar. Uh, hard to believe a journey that we started uh, a little bit around three years ago. And, you know, this is really a celebration more than anything. It's a celebration for all the people that designed and developed are now building the Ford GT as a showcase for us as a company of our strength and innovation, our commitment to delivering more for our customers. You know, the GT is being built here along with our other performance vehicles to provide a platform to showcase Ford's technology achievements and innovations. These are the technologies that are gonna make a significant impact across our entire lineup, whether it's the lightweight materials, the aerodynamics, the EcoBoost technologies, and what an exciting journey it's been in developing those technologies, and what an incredible team that's brought us here today. You know, in late 2013, we brought the team together, the Ford GT team, together in a street secret design studio deep within our product development center in Dearborn. And we told the team that we're gonna build an all new Ford GT. And the reason is first, we wanna celebrate the 50th anniversary of that historic win at Le Mans where the Ford GT40 came in one, two, three. And second, we wanted to do it to show our commitment as a company to our capabilities in delivering technologies typically only offered in elite vehicles. The fact that we managed to keep it secret right up to the 2015 NIAS Auto Show still amazes me because our friends in the media usually have a way of finding out things a little bit before we'd like them to find out about it. And as we developed the car from the outset, we wanted to ensure that we had a car that had what it takes to return Ford to GT racing. And so there were certainly challenging moments in that. Um, but in mid-June, we arrived at Le Mans, recognizing the eyes of the racing world were on us. Uh, as you can imagine, the pressure was pretty high. We had most of the Ford family with us, most of Ford management with us. But it was an amazing weekend. A lot of activity, a lot of anxious moments, to be honest. But the key is we won. And actually, we came in one, three, and four. So that's something that the Ford fans all around the world will share with us for the rest of our lives. But we had two primary objectives in 2016 to achieve with this program. The first, to excel at Le Mans, and to start production vehicles and delivering supercars to their customers by year end. And now, we've achieved both. We've also learned a lot along the way. You know, the engine in this, this car, the EcoBoost engine, is now race proven. And the packaging wouldn't have been possible if we didn't have an engine that's so compact yet powerful. The aerodynamics, the light weighting, are all now race proven. And so this is close to as a racing car on the street as you're going to get. And we're excited about the amount of enthusiasm that's generated, especially when we received over 6,500 applications from people around the world to purchase this car. So winning at Le Mans, developing the Ford GT road car all at the same time, it's been tremendously rewarding, and we're really proud that it's now on its way to its first owners. And that could only be possible by having a passionate and talented team involved at every level of this program. So this job one ceremony is a significant milestone, obviously, for the project, but it's an amazing proud point for all the people who have been involved with the Ford GT. So obviously, besides the various teams at Ford, I'd especially like to thank Multimatic, Brembo, Michelin, Broza, Rausch, Sparco, and Bosch, and many others for bringing their passion and expertise to this project and commitment to the beautiful car that's here today. So thank you for joining us here today. I wish you all a very happy and festive season and happy new year, and I look forward to sharing the Ford GT with you in the future. Thanks again, and thanks to all the fans that are online with us as well. Thank you.